Hello, and I have something good, and it's gonna be awesome. I bought this Ultra Prism box for 20 bucks. So let's see what kind of awesomeness is gonna be in here. Uh, hopefully some gold or maybe that full art uh, Cynthia card, because that would be awesome. I want that Cynthia card more than the gold, but I won't care which one I pull, as long as it's better than the, uh, the last Ultra Prism Elite Trainer box that I did, because that was an embarrassment. I think we only got, what, like a hollow or two in there? Yeah. Anyways, let's get all this good stuff out of the way, and usually I'll get the other box. This time I went with the Sol Galio box, and then the the book, which is a little, has a different cover, but basically everything is exactly the same. So yeah, let's toss all that down, rip this open, get these packs out with one, two, three, some counters, four, five, six, seven. Where are you, number eight? Oh, buried way down at the bottom. So much cardboard. We have sleeves, look at that. Oh, they're yellow and not blue. That's cool, new sleeves. And the code card for the box, which I will either put on Instagram or do it at the end of this video. It depends. If we pull a full art, I will do it at the end of this video. If not, well, then we're going to have to give it away on Instagram. So let's put these packs somewhere over here. Let's do this little focus, kind of giving it a little bit of a something pretty to look at for for later all right let's uh get this stuff out of the way now that i randomly did that for some weird reason for you guys that are watching like why did he just stack those in a pile and then take them away yes i know but hey what use it for uh the cover art Anyways, let's, uh, hey, look at that. They're all facing the right way. Let's get right into that. That is way out of focus. So I hope you guys saw that. Let's uh, focus in right now. And let's show off that first energy, dark energy. All right. We have a monk, a orangutan, orangaguru. I really need to get this into a better focus for you guys. Uh, Unite Energy, Rosalina, Chimchar, Electric Squirrel, Scorpion, Young Goose, our Aloan Dig Dug Trio. Aloan Dug Trio is our reverse and our rare is a non-holographic Heat Rotom. All right, let's go into this Leafeon pack. Maybe we can pull a Glaceon, my favorite EV evolution. Throw that off to there. And one, two, three. I should just start doing four to the front, but it's more fun doing it that way. As long as I don't run into any X and Y packs and switch back and forth, then it kind of gets confusing. Anyways, we got an otter, a weasel, an electric memory, Mars, with a really weird skirt, the cutest Eevee picture, artwork, on a card, we'll set you back there, weird looking magmar, some fungus, a penguin, a weird lizard, our reverse is a reverse rare, and our rare is a non-holographic Garchomp so we have I'll put the reverse rare back there two packs down nothing pulled yet and there is that code card 
with another dark energy. All right, there is a trainer. Bird, penguin, whatever. Magmar looking all weird. He needs to straighten his posture some. He's too hunched forward. A low and diglet up on top of a mountain watching the sunset. Sneasel. Magnemite. Looks like he is chopping some grass. Very happy looking. A knitted cherry type Pokemon. A Pokemon fan club. That seems like it should be a family, more of a than a fan club. And a Morotom. We've got all right, I am no more Elite Trainer Boxes for Ultra Prism. I have not pulled anything good. Uh, I've opened three of these and I haven't pulled anything. One, two, three, and a Psychic Energy. I'll put this, I like that card. Is there a full art of that, I think? It's not in this set, is it? I don't think so. But I believe there is a full art Pokemon fan club, and that would be a pretty cool thing to pull. We've got a... I'm trying to read this, not that. What does that say? Seafaring? What the heck does that mean? Anyways, Garbite, Dupiter, a penguin winking at us. Wink, 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 wink. What are you trying to tell us? What are you trying to tell us, Penguin? They have a Scorpion, a Skunk, a Yongoose. Oh, that is cool. We got a Solgaleo, Prism Star, very nice. And our rare is a, boom, a Dark Necrozma GX. Well, I take that back, what I just said. We have some two pretty cool poles. Dark, no, dar, Dusk. Main Nucrasma and a Dolgaleo. Pretty sweet. Let's sleeve those up. One, two, two sleeves for one pack. That is pretty cool. And all right. Let's go into our full. No, our fifth pack. Come on, this one doesn't even want to open. We're gonna have to open it backwards. There we go. And there is the code card for you guys who are watching this. First, and I know these code cards go pretty quickly, so turn that uh, notification on. And if you haven't subscribed, please do it. Please, that'd be awesome. Fire Memory, Bronzong. And get this into focus for this. Shinex. Shinex. However, you want to pronounce that. I have two different piles going on over here. I don't know why. Dewbiter. Gribble. A scorpion. Lick a tongue. Hopping across some rocks. Don't want to get wet. And our reverse is not a reverse rare. And our rare is a frost rotom. I'm pretty sure we're going to have every single one of these in this pack. Let me uh, find the three that we've pulled so far. Maybe. Where are you? I know you're in here. You're in like the first one. There we go. So we're only missing a couple. One more. Two more. Something more. All right. Let's put the Rotoms back here because I'm sure we're going to end up pulling another one. I got cards all over the place now. And, oh my gosh, what happened there? Look at that code card, it is bent. Are the rest of my cards like that? No, they're not. They're in okay condition by the looks of it, but that's weird that the code card was all, looks like someone bit on it. Look at that, it's like, I don't know if you guys can really tell, like if, looking at this thing, it looks like those are like a bite mark right there. That's really weird. Did I do the uh, energy? No, I did not. There it is. There's the fairy energy. All right, Brong Zong. Fire memory. A bunny rabbit with a berry 
for a seed. There's a sand hippo. Our reverse is a reverse rare and our rare is a holographic. Interesting. Hollow can go up there. All right, two packs left. And we have the code card. One, two, three. And electric energy and a galaxy looking Pokemon. Cynthia, where are you for our Cynthia? I would really love to pull you. That might be worth something, I think. We'll put that back there. A skunk, a chimchar, a bunny. A very angry looking uh, plant, Sneasel. Our reverse is a reverse Chimchar, and our rare is a Glaceon! I love you, Glaceon! It's not a full art, but I'll take it. Sweet! Yes! We have two GXs. Both, neither of them are full art, but I don't care. All right, this is the last pack. All right, what do you got for us? What do you have? Last pack. We got some decent pulls, but I would love a fuller. I would love Cynthia. Cynthia, where are you? I would love to meet you. I would love to meet the full art Cynthia that everybody talks about. There is the grass energy, leap energy, whichever. We have a dinosaur and a guy that is about to get electrocuted, a dragonfly, chimchar, a, gra a electric squirrel, a Loan Vulpix, and a Loan Sandshrew. A Loan Vulpix, best picture ever. I love this artwork. This artwork is awesome. This is probably my favorite A Loan Vulpix artwork. You can go back here with the cards that I like. Bronzor, our reverse is a reverse weird fire turtle. And our rare for the final pack is a non-holographic sand hippo. Anyways, there are those. And we had some pretty decent pulls. I mean, this Glaceon, you can't really all oh, me, uh, since I love Glaceon, uh, can't get better than that, other than a full art, maybe. And then we got the Dusk Main Necrozma. Gotta say that slow so I don't get all twisted up on it. And then a Solgaleo. Leo, Solgaleo. Prism Star card. And then we got the two reverse rares. And I don't know why I put this. Oh, yeah, that's a hollow. That didn't look like a hollow sitting back there. We got a regular hollow. And then we have the most adorable EV card ever. Let's get that into focus. There we go. And a low on Vulpix that I love this artwork. I wish I could get this in a bigger picture and I can just put it on my wall somewhere. That would be. That'd be amazing. And then the Pokemon Fan Club, which I'm going to call the Pokemon Family. And then Cynthia. I need to find the full art Cynthia. I don't care about the gold cards. Even though the title of this video is gonna be called Searching for Gold, I want that full art Cynthia. Full art trainers over full art Pokemon any day. Anyways, the code card. I guess I'll do it because I found a Glaceon. So here is everything but the first three. I'm going to talk for a little bit for like 30 seconds and then I will do the other part of it. So please subscribe to this video. Follow me on Instagram for all the amazing photos that I put up. At least I think they're amazing. Uh, I'm sure some of you guys that already follow me think they're amazing too or at least like them enough to keep following me. And uh, you can find me on Twitter and Facebook, but 
the easiest way to get a hold of me if let's say you wanted to mail something to me because I now have that uh, the option to do that um, just would be Instagram because I am constantly on there for some reason but either of these social media uh, networks will work so get a hold of me even if you want to talk I will talk to anybody about Pokemon or whatever's going on in your life I love to make new friends so anyways I guess the other part of this code card is there so I hope you guys get some good pulls out of that let's rip that up so I don't accidentally find it on the front ground later and think it's the other box that I opened because I still have to give that one away and I'm gonna post that on uh, Instagram shortly maybe before this video hits or sometime after anyways it's gonna make its way up there for a giveaway so if you want that code card just find that picture on my Instagram and follow the instructions I mean usually only one person ever ever goes for it anyways so yeah i think that does it for this video and until my next video i will see you guys goodbye